late Dr. Spencer Reed. Do you find slipping into the social awkwardness quite easy now? I never slipped out of it to become him. So <laughs> that's one thing that's remained. That's the one part of the acting that is not acting. So that, that, that part's the, easy, the easiest of it. Is the long hair an expression of rebellion? It, it was a little bit. And I thought, again, I always saw him initially as a long haired character merely because I, I wanted him to be more of like an esoteric, uh, like Oscar Wilde type. And so I grew it long. And then I thought after some change, life changing things that he went through on the show, he might cut it to purge himself from the darkness. But I'm like, what do you prefer? Oh, I think this suits you best. Oh, really? Oh, well, then I'll, we'll keep this. Time. Also, um, I've noticed your socks a few times have oh, been yeah. photographed as being like, odd socks, one yeah. red, one blue. I'll, I'll be together today. So oh, yeah, never. Not. They never, the never, socks. never what matching. I, 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 in my head, for some reason, when I was little, my grandmother told me it was good luck to wear mismatching socks. So I always try to prescribe to that belief. You bring quite a lot of fun to the to this show. Oh, thank you. And um, obviously, criminal minds can be a bit dark. Do you find that quite emotionally difficult to deal with? Yeah, it really is. It, it starts to drive you insane after a while. But um, luckily, we've we've got a very funny crew and cast, so we have we have so much fun when the cameras aren't rolling that it it reverses the the negativity. <laughs> and also, I've heard that you bring quite a lot of fun behind the scenes as well. Oh, tell us about the Goobies. Oh yeah, the Goobies. Yeah, thanks for asking. It's. It's basically an offensive award show. Someone was very sad. In America, there's like award ceremonies, which I don't really think are, I, I'm, I'm not into awarding art, but um, they were sad because we weren't nominated. So I created as a joke, I said, well, we're nominated for 20 Gooby Awards. And they're basically like embarrassing awards that you wouldn't want to win, but for some reason, people are always trying to win. They're like, I want to win the, the ugliest facial hair award this year. I want to win the... My wife is much more beautiful than me award. It's a sort of a funny, funny little things to like make fun of ourselves. I presented Shamar Moore with, he's exceptionally late all the time. So we gave him a solid gold painted alarm clock and he won the lifetime achievement in actor consistently late to work award. That's <laughs> so, something to be proud of. Yeah. He's proud of, he has it on his mantle. He doesn't use it though. So the clock was not, not well received.